with this guy, bro. Like, hold on. Hold on, hold on. And uh, I got told that the the card readers are not working, so it's cash only. Girl. Morning. What up, Debbie Deb? <laughs> to get a new pair of glasses. Lord. This ain't nothing working. Look. Oh, did you get yours to work? <laughs> no, what's doing? Uh, it's not doing my coffee. It ain't doing nothing. These things is all messed up today. See, they just both calculated, both of them. It's barely 6 to 6 or 2 a.m. and everything is effed up. Yeah, that's what I said. I was willing to turn those off too. I saw passion at the door. Do you guys have enough change to break a hundred in our own No, we got it. Alright. I'm fixing up my change. Oh. For the register. I, I thought one of the customers like handed it to you and was like, oh, they've yeah. done that to me before, like, and I'm like, <laughs> Thanks for the 40 bucks. What a beat. So it hasn't been that long and I'm just looking at the uh, truck right now. I was kind of hiding in the office for a minute because I'm not even lying to you. There was a storm of people inside the store and I was like, because all we're accepting is cash right now. But like, we're also running out of cash to be giving for change. And we have a lot of landscapers that pay with $100 bills for like $1 items. So um, they take all of our change by doing that. And then we run out of money and yeah. So anyway, um, Debbie is already having a day. She's not in a good mood because everything is messed up. And I don't blame her, but at the same time, we don't need an attitude. We don't need any bad attitude. Because I'm trying to be in oblivion right now. I'm trying to remain calm. And by remaining calm, I just pretend that everything's okay whenever it's not. That's how I don't end up killing people. So if I have to remain calm by just keeping my head in Delulu land, yeah. then let me play the game. And you play along too. Play along too. Anyway, yeah, I'm looking at the truck and this is what it looks like. That thing. That thing. I forgot to grab a car. So now I'm gonna have to go get the car. Mm -hmm. Also wanna stop. Because I don't want to do this. Little oh, Debbie Cakes is hating her life right now. <laughs> because our self-checkouts are down and we have a line literally of people. Like imagine this is how regular gas stations Regular gas stations, you have to work in line. Anytime that I even have to think about going to the gas station, I don't like going because I know there's going to be some lottery person in the line that's holding up the whole line. And that's like, I don't want like ever a cup of ice or something. But yeah, like, self checkouts are way more gas It's kind of why I like the self checkout. One of the pros is you can just get in and out, you don't have to talk to nobody. Like, I like that. I did so I had to do the trashes because the trashes were bad. I'm making food. I got a truck to put away. Debbie's having to stand behind this damn cash register because everywhere in the U.S. is having a freaking issue with their computers and their card reader thingy. So nobody can pay with cards in here. Freaking crazy. Like, ew. Who wants to deal with people? Whenever I go to a gas station now and they don't have self-checkouts, I'm just like, you know what? I'll go somewhere else. I just won't get anything. I'll just literally and then I just leave. So, I'm already used to this, and I like it like this, so, um, robots also fail. Once again, robots failing, or whoever's supposed to do the update, they fail, and that's why our place is only cash only right now. So, yeah. Scary, scary time. So, I gotta 
right now I finished labeling sandwiches so now I'm going on a Dunkin run because I needed a motivational break because I am doing this shit okay and Debbie was feeling like everything was spiraling which it really was but once we found out it was a nationwide problem and not just our store sucking um, it really did lighten the mood a little bit and made everyone feel a little bit better so I just started like really getting cracking on cooking breakfast food and just cooking lunch getting a head start and I think that made her feel a lot less overwhelmed because she was thinking about everything that she was gonna have to do but since I did it for her then it was less overwhelming for her so I did some cooking in between labeling sandwiches um, I only have to work the totes and that's probably gonna take me like literally a couple of hours maybe even less because it wasn't even that much so I pretty much got this shit in the bag also I have to do the outside pump trashes because those are all full so I'm gonna be doing the trashes before it starts raining really bad and I really want to get that out of the way before it gets like super torturous outside but yeah I got this shit in the bag dude I'm pretty much good at everything and uh, anytime I feel down about myself I'm just gonna start thinking about everything that I do because I'm freaking off like literally I don't give myself enough credit like but yeah, I'm going to Duncan right now. Bye. I got my freaking Duncan refresher. I have to do this for the shit. I'm just going to go to the and kill me. Hi. Yeah. I gotta do this trash. I got my four boots. I did those same things. Look at that. Amazing. I don't know how long it took, but I feel like I did this way faster than one of the boys. All of the boys. We're gonna need two hands for this, so gotta go. Fifteen. Look at my face. Is it really red? Because I'm embarrassed. I did all the trashes. I think I did them in like 15 minutes. I don't know. I wasn't timing it, but it felt like 15 minutes. But now I deserve a drink. You drink great. I just think the aftermath of me doing everything. These are the trashes. Yeah. Get it in done. Here. Okay guys, Deb Deb finally came back with the food. I'm just gonna sit in my car for a minute and eat in peace so that way no one bothers me. She got me some chicken from Danny's. But I paid for it. So, yeah. Just saying. I'm not a freeloader. I'm really not. What is that? Oh, vendor. But yeah, I'm just gonna sit in my car and eat it in peace because I don't want to be around people. And plus, I'm getting a headache from people. Uh, excuse me. 
Okay. Hot, oh, so fresh. Okay, dudes, it is like 30 minutes until I get out of this bitch. I've been doing nothing but working non freaking stuff. I got a scratch on my leg. I had to waste out like so much milk. Probably like a hundred little individual things of milk. Crazy. But anyway, Josh is here to work the evening shoes. Me and Debbie are fed up with this place. Well, dudes, I have a lot of drinks in my hand because one's water, one's my strawberry dragon fruit drink tea refresher, and the other one's a, my strawberry dragon fruit drink tea refresher that I have left over. And yeah, I'm out of this freaking beach. It's been raining today. My knee hurts from whenever I accidentally bumped into a crate, a milk crate. Anyway, yeah, it was a freaking kind of a stressful day. I was like kind of annoyed today, not even gonna lie, because I was just on such a mission. But we got that done, we did the truck out of here hope you guys like this video hit that like button if you did subscribe if you want to be a part of my growing channel thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you on the next one bye